Okay, now the next one's my favorite. So your celebrations. We're gonna we're gonna take some time to talk about your celebrations. So what was your first ever celebration that you had? Uh, it was actually the dance that um, it's called the bus driver celebration. Bus driver it just one, came right? up again. <laughs> yeah, um, you know, obviously I like having fun in the field, so it's just something we came up with. Um, one of my teammates from the Titans, and then uh, when I got to the IPL, actually KL Rahul asked me about it, and I was okay. like, "Oh, okay, that's interesting." Um, obviously, he knew about it, and and he wanted to do the celebration, and uh, Virat well, we wanted did to it do as the well, celebration. Yeah. <laughs> you know, it's just a bit of fun. You know, um, we we playing against the top players in the world under pressure with millions of people watching. Um, you know, there's a lot of pressure. So yeah. my philosophy is that. Um, I need to be able to enjoy myself exactly. while I'm doing what I love. So exactly. That's why we start playing cricket. Um, and yeah, that's just that's just um, that's just the theory behind my celebrations. Why mustn't I have fun while I'm while I'm enjoying what, yeah. I, what I love doing? So where did the other ones come from? Like, where did you think of doing the shoe celebration and having like you know <laughs> the magician celebration and all these? Like, where do you think of them? You know, because your your celebrations are definitely the more unique ones compared to you know most of the other celebrations that are there. Mm -hmm. Yeah, you know, a lot of people think like you know those whole celebrations and stuff. You're not focusing on the field. I mean, I'm not thinking on my celebrations while I'm bowling. You know, it's it's it what comes afterwards and. It's just my way of, of making memories and enjoying myself. The shoe phone thing is, you know, like sometimes when, when the umpires call the third umpire to confirm if it's out or not. So that's just my way of just checking if it's out. Yeah, it's out. You know, just, okay. you know, phoning the third umpire. Um, also once, um, I remember clearly it was one of the games where um, I was speaking to Abby de Villiers about a certain batsman. And we had discussed the plan and it actually yeah. worked out. He wasn't playing that game for the Titans, so it was just like you know, if I get him out like that, I'm gonna phone you. So it's just um, it's just um, fun stuff like that. And as for the magician stuff, um, I really wanted to be a magician when I was younger, um, up until the age of probably 14, 15, 16. Yeah. Um, and then obviously cricket took over, and I started playing it more seriously. Um, so I couldn't practice anymore. But you know, that that's been one of my hobbies. Um, it's something I enjoy. Um, just to see the amazing, uh, you know, there's just people's faces when, when they don't understand what's going on. And it's sort of like spin bowling, isn't it? You have to outfox yeah. the batsman. Um, exactly. So it's just.